Did play, in your opinion, most of your strengths? I mean, what, what do you like about it? Uh, I just think it keeps the defense honest. Uh, I mean, you really will run pass options. You really can't just be heavy loaded and really be running the pass. You, know, you can't have guys sink on the pass. You can't have guys loaded in the box. Uh, being that on those plays, you get both. So you have to be prepared for both. You have to be disciplined uh, with your eyes. And uh, I don't know, it just, for offense, it, the defense is never right. I mean, there's sometimes with bad look, I mean, we gain two yards, you know, we'll take it. But at the end of the day, I think it uh, puts us in the best position to attack the type of defense. You guys, had, you had a sling to the flat, I think, to Austin Mack at one point that, that looked very much like a play Baker Mayfield had <laughs> uh, the week before. Was that a little bit of a copycat, or is that just the way it, that, that play can work sometimes? No, that's uh, we had that play in our offense before. I had never seen you really do that, though. Go ahead. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we, there's a lot of plays you have done. Yeah. 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 There's a lot of plays you have to play. But, um, yeah, so that was uh, one of those type plays. Uh, it was kind of like a triple option. Mm -hmm. uh, really, I mean, behind the line of scrimmage, so it was one of those uh, Kind of the ones where I throw above, but that one was in the body, so it was just uh, him doing one step. Just look around. But does it play to your strengths? I mean, stand up, it looks like you have good recognition of what you're seeing in front of you. I mean, that's for one of a, another phrase. Do, do you feel like that's playing to your strength, that triple option sort of look? Yeah, I think uh, with my ability to run, uh, guys are going to you know, kind of collapse on me and then be able to throw it out uh, last second. Uh, and then, just making the right decision. Uh, don't have us in you know, terrible plays. Like if it looks funky, then you know, gain two yards, get down, or throw it away, whatever the case may be. But um, I think uh, coaches have a trust in me, knowing that it is a bad look just to manage it this way. Hey, JT, I think that more than half of your uh, completions on Saturday were completions behind the line of scrimmage. I was wondering, how does that, you know, help you in, in your game? Does it open other things up? Can this team be successful uh, long term with that as a major part of the passing game in terms of you know, opening up the run and, and maybe taking a shot downfield over the top? I mean, how does throwing laterally help? And if you guys did have struggles throwing the ball downfield, does that help ease the issue a little bit? Yeah, so, I mean, the times we did take our shots downfield, the guy was at like 15 yards and he was bad. So they, they were not happening as far as us getting behind them. Uh, so with that, throwing bubs, uh, off that we can have, uh, you know, we pump a bub and go downfield. Uh, we can still throw bubs. I mean, there's a lot of things that come off of that. Um, being that we attack horizontally uh, the field. So uh, I think it does help us, uh, being that they have to account for that now. But yeah, as far as dropping back and Throwing the ball downfield, college game I think is getting away from that, and I think even with us, we people know we have you know, playmakers on our side with a lot of speed, so they're just sagging off. Uh, so now that definitely will help us going down. The line. Can that work against a team that has equal talent on the other side of the ball? Yeah, well, it's almost like misdirection. So uh, you know the days watching Oregon do that all the time. Yeah. Same thing. So uh, it's kind of like the misdirection. I mean, you're seeing this, you're getting that same look going. Uh, Screen out there, throwing screen out there, then we fake screen, go deep. So all that uh, the defense, defense you, has to be ready for that. Could you see the defense even adjusting to that within the game, since that was some stuff you had to show as much of? Yeah. So I mean, they were trying to rally to it as best they could, but we were playing a little faster, uh, and I think uh, our guys did a great job blocking out there. So I think they were trying to, you know, rally and get more people over there. I think being able to get it out fast in my hands and all. Receivers blocking helped a lot. JT, Coach Meyer said uh, yesterday that the next step in this offense, they just he wants to see continued growth in this offense. What do you think is the next logical step in that direction? I think, um, I don't know, just better execution on things, uh, playing faster. Uh, I mean, Coach is great as to see as far as our tempo, so we definitely play faster. Better execution on things, like I said. I don't know, I think all around, all around, everybody just picking up their game and uh, executing better. JT, what was it like to have Joe back? I know he got fully cleared. Uh, how's he, how did you see him work through that injury? It was kind of a major setback for him in this 